Hello everybody, this is my video on uh, heavily circulated coins. First up is the barber half. That's uh, almost completely slick. You can still see the outline of his head and the eagle a little bit. Then there's a barber quarter. Same thing there. And here's a shield nickel. But you can barely see the details on it. There's two Liberty nickels. There's a two cent piece. Here's a bust large cent. I got it from Coin Collector 17. It's another large cent. Real worn. No date. And then there's a Indian scent. And finally, for the slick coins, it's a half cent. You can see the outline of the head a little bit there. That's pretty much gone right there. Okay, next we come to the damaged and corroded type coins. First, my quarters. See the black in the fields there. Not worth anything, but it looks cool. Then there's this quarter. You can see what's wrong with this. Then there's this quarter. If you look at if you look uh, at it closely, like see right here where the, their metal is shiny, that's a bump coming up. And on the other side, there's a bump coming up over here. Like there's something sandwiched between the metal. I don't know how else that would happen. Because there's no, there's no, it's not, there's no dent on the other side that goes in. Just two dents that come out on opposite sides okay and the dimes got a bus dime looks like somebody chewed on it okay that side there's another looks like teeth marks Then there's this Roosevelt dime. See the edge right there? I'm not sure if this is an error or uh, um, just something somebody messed up, but uh, worth keeping. Okay, next is nickels. Got a bunch of buffalo nickels that looks like they may have been. I know these three right here came from a, a guy who does metal detecting. And these over here just look the same, sort of. So I figured maybe they're buried too. Okay. Then there's a Jefferson nickel that's black too. Maybe it was buried. And then there's two bent ones, just slightly bent. And then one where somebody put tape on it a long time ago. So, ruined in my opinion.
There's another black nickel. This is a Civil War nickel that was in a fire. You see, you can see the uh, Jefferson Memorial a little bit on the back there. It's pretty cool. And there's two more Jefferson nickels that are really destroyed. Okay, on to pennies. Okay, sorry about that. Cat knocked over my shit. Okay, first we have four pennies with holes in them. Penny with this oval punch in it. Two bent pennies. It's a penny with the bottom squashed. Penny with this, I don't know, chop taken out of it or whatever you want to call it. These are just two crusty pennies. This one's a steel scent. Now these three, it looks like, or not these three. These three, it looks like they may have been, been around welding equipment or something. That one looks like it's been welded. These look like sparks from a welder hit them and they're like corroded out yeah this one it just looks like the stuff just rotted off or something somebody chipped it off roughly and there's this one it's just worn scraped up See real messed up ones. And the last one I gotta show you is this. I'm not sure what kind of penny it is, but it's I got it from the same metal detectorist who gave me those buffalo nickels. It's pretty cool. It's like barely held together I guess it's like one big thing of rust I like it anyways that's the end of my video I'll see y'all next time